Hi friends, this is Pastor Lucas Spina, and this is our snack for the journey. And this week we are in the book of Romans, book of Romans, a letter that Paul wrote to the Romans, a very important letter. So I'd like to encourage you to keep reading, reading more than once, keep reading. It's a very important letter. If you want to know the doctrine of Christianity, you have to read this letter. We don't have time to go to all the details and the and the, and the deep and, and in this letter because it's just what we have here is just a snack for your journey it's just a short meditation to help you in your spiritual journey that that is our goal here and before i read the verse for today i'd like to encourage you to share uh, this video with your friends and family and, and and subscribe to our channel and help us to bless other people verse for today chapter 3 verse 9 very important verse what shall we conclude then? Are we any better? Are, are we any better? Not at all. We have already made the charge that Jews and Gentiles alike are all under sin. This is a great, great statement because Paul here is, is putting, he is writing to a church that has Jews and Gentiles together. They are there. And sometimes the Jews say, hey, we, have, we are the people of the covenant. We are, we are the sons and children of Abraham. We have all the covenant and all that kind of thing. And Paul says, look, we are all in the same boat. <laughs> we are all sinners. It doesn't matter if you are a Jew or if you are a Gentile. We are all sinners. We are under sin. There is no difference there. And it's very important for us to understand that because Paul is saying, look, what we should conclude, are we any better? They said, we, the, the, the Jews, are, are we any better? And Paul says, no, not at all. There is no difference. It's not what you do. They say, well, the, that person goes to church, or that person does that, so they, they are going to be treated in a different way. No, we are all under sin. This is what Paul is saying. That is the foundation. This is why we need a Savior. The, the coming of Christ, it's important. It's necessary. Because we are all, we saw in, in the last video, we are all under condemnation. God is going to judge us. So we need to understand that. So we are all under sin. There is no difference. Everybody everybody is a sinner and needs a needs a soul of a savior you must understand that you must understand that that you need a savior i need a savior i cannot do it by myself because i am under sin and paul here put everybody in the same boat we are all under sin there is no exception there is no little group there that is better than the other group here, or the family, or, or, or ethnicity, or race. No, everybody is a sinner. We are all under sin, and we all need a Savior. This is why we need Jesus. All of us, everyone, we need Jesus if we want to be saved and not found out ourselves in the condemnation that we saw in the last video this is what paul is saying everybody everybody is under sin and it's a very important lesson for all of us for all of us we all need a savior and this is our snack for today god bless you